Hoover is a city in Jefferson and Shelby counties in north-central Alabama, United States. The largest suburb near Birmingham, the city had a population of 84,848 as of the 2015 U.S. Census estimate. Hoover is part of the Birmingham-Hoover, Alabama Metropolitan Statistical Area and is also included in the Birmingham-Hoover-Talladega, AL Combined Statistical Area. Hoover's territory is along the foothills of the Appalachian Mountains. Hoover is home to the Riverchase Galleria, one of the largest shopping centers in the southeast and one of the largest mixed-use centers in the U.S. It includes retail, hotel and office space. The Birmingham Barons minor league baseball team, which traces its history to 1885, played its home games at the 10,800-seat Hoover Metropolitan Stadium until 2013, when it moved to Birmingham. History This suburban area near the foothills of the Appalachian Mountains had been known as the Green Valley Community since the 1930s, it was mostly a bedroom or residential community into the late 1970s and early 1980s. The city of Hoover was incorporated in 1967, named for William H. Hoover 1890 a local insurance company owner. Its small city hall included space for the police department. On September 8, 1980, the city annexed the Riverchase business and residential community, gaining large office buildings, employers, and workers to increase the city's tax base. When Interstate I-459 was opened, a major interchange with Interstate I-65 was constructed within the borders of Hoover, improving access. In 1986 the Riverchase Galleria multi-use complex opened, it has significantly increased the tax revenue for the city. It has also attracted new residents and businesses to the area. The city has grown extremely fast, aided by its annexations of territory as well as new developments. The city has expanded its facilities, and now operates a municipal center, library, and public safety center. The city expects to continue to increase in population, which has risen significantly since 2008. It numbered 81,619 as of the 2010 census. Geography <inaudible> 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 Hoover is located at 33 degrees 23 minutes 11 seconds north 86 degrees 48 minutes 18 seconds west according to the US Census Bureau the city has a total area of 43.65 square miles 113.1 square kilometers of which 43.13 square miles 111.7 square kilometers is land and 0.51 square miles 1.3 square kilometers 1.17% is water. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Government. The municipal government has operated under the mayor-council form of government since incorporation. The mayor and city council are elected on a nonpartisan basis to concurrent four-year terms of office, which begin on October 1st of election year. Policy making and legislative authority is vested in the City Council, which consists of seven at large elected members. Prior to 2004, the Council consisted of five at large members. Candidates for at large elections must gain a majority of voters. Such a system limits the ability of minority voters to elect candidates of their choice. The City Council is responsible for considering local resolutions and ordinances, adopting an annual budget, and appointing members to local boards and committees. The Mayor is responsible for carrying out and enforcing the City's policies and ordinances. Economy <inaudible> 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 The Riverchase Galleria Shopping Hotel office complex generates tax revenues for the city, it is also the location of numerous retail, hotel, and office workers. The Riverchase Office Park, and other office parks and buildings throughout Hoover, house many large corporations. 
Major shopping centers in the city include Riverchase Galleria on US 31, Patton Creek on State Route 150, and Village at Lee Branch on US 280. The central business district is intersected by US 31, State Route 150, and US 280. I-65 and I-459 intersect in the city. Largest taxpayers Hoover 2015 Annual Financial Report, ranking by largest sales and used taxpayers Costco Walmart Sam's Club Belk Target Regions Bank Publix Home Depot Best Buy Macy's Topic largest employers Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Alabama Company Headquarters 3000 Hoover Board of Education 1773 Regions Financial Operations Center 1765 AT&T Inc Data Center 1143 City of Hoover 745 Walmart 2 Supercenters and 2 Neighborhood Market Stores 650 T-Mobile 500 BE&K 302 Topic Public Safety Hoover Fire Department is a full-time career department operating from 10 fire stations throughout the city. The city has one battalion. There are eight engine companies, two quints, one ladder trucks, three ALS rescue, ambulances, and two battalion chief cars. All engine companies are staffed with a minimum of three, with at least two being firefighter, paramedics. All engines are classified ALS advanced life support. The department also operates one heavy rescue truck, and one hazmat unit. Hoover Fire Department holds a Class 1 ISO rating. In 2016, the department responded to over 10,000 calls. Hoover's first chief of police was Oscar Davis. In 2006, the police force of the city of Hoover purchased 104 Chevrolet Police Tahoes to support sustainability. The Hoover Police Department now has the largest law enforcement fleet in the nation to run on E85, a fuel that is 85% ethanol and 15% gasoline. President George W. Bush visited the city in September 2006 to see the fleet and fueling facility. Hoover operates its own enhanced 911 emergency call center, which has eight operator positions and is staffed 24-7. Hoover provides traffic, severe weather, disaster information, and details on special events on low-power AM radio 1610 kilohertz. Topic: Demographics. As of the census of 2000, there were 62,742 people, 25,191 households, and 17,406 families residing in the city. The population density was 1,454.6 people per square mile, 561.7 per square kilometers. There were 27,150 housing units at an average density of 629.4 per square miles, 243.0 per square kilometers. The racial makeup of the city was 87.66% white, 6.77% black, 0.16% Native American, 2.89% Asian, 0.03% Pacific Islander, 1.40% from other races, and 1.09% from two or more races. 3.79% of the population were Hispanic or Latino of any race. There were 25,191 households out of which 33.4% had children under the age of 18 living with them, 59.4% were married couples living together, 7.2% had a female householder with no husband present, and 30.9% were non-families, 25.9% of all households were made up of individuals and 6.3% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. 
the average household size was 2.47 and the average family size was 3.00. In the city, the population was spread out with 24.8% under the age of 18, 7.9% from 18 to 24, 32.6% from 25 to 44, 23.8% from 45 to 64, and 10.9% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 36 years. For every 100 females, there were 95.1 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 91.5 males. According to a 2007 estimate, the median income for a household in the city was $75,365, and the median income for a family was $89,513. Males had a median income of $55,660 versus $34,836 for females. The per capita income for the city was $33,361. About 2.1% of families and 3.4% of the population were below the poverty line, including 2.7% of those under age 18 and 3.9% of those age 65 or over. Topic: 2010 census. As of the census of 2010, there were 84,126 people, 32,478 households, and 22,476 families residing in the city. The population density was 1,870.3 people per square mile per square kilometers. There were 35,474 housing units at an average density of 812.9 per square miles (313.9 per square kilometers). The racial makeup of the city was 75.1% white, 14.8% black, 0.2% Native American, 5.1% Asian, 0.0% Pacific Islander, 3.2% from other races, and 1.5% from two or more races. 6.0% of the population were Hispanic or Latino of any race. There were 32,478 households out of which 33.0% had children under the age of 18 living with them, 56.1% were married couples living together, 10.0% had a female householder with no husband present, and 30.8% were non-families, 25.8% of all households were made up of individuals and 7.6% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.50 and the average family size was 3.02. In the city, the population was spread out with 25.0% under the age of 18, 7.8% from 18 to 24, 28.7% from 25 to 44, 26.6% from 45 to 64, and 12.0% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 37 years. For every 100 females, there were 92.5 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 92.4 males. The median income for a household in the city was $72,960, and the median income for a family was $94,066. Males had a median income of $65,023 versus $44,525 for females. The per capita income for the city was $39,141. About 3.4% of families and 5.6% of the population were below the poverty line, including 6.6% of those under age 18 and 3.5% of those age 65 or over. Topic: Transportation. Hoover is served by two interstate highways, 65 and 459, with a major interchange near the center of the city. 
Major arterial roads include U.S. Route 31 as a north-south route through the middle of the city, U.S. Route 280 in the eastern portion of the city, Route 150 as an east-west road connecting the city center to the western side, and Valleydale Road connecting Route 31 and Route 280. Hoover is also served by the Birmingham-Jefferson County Transit Authority. Topic: Communities. Topic: Parks. Topic: Education. Topic. Primary and secondary schools Hoover is served by Hoover City Schools. It has ten elementary schools, three middle schools, and two high schools, Spain Park High School and Hoover High School. Reflecting the socioeconomic profile of parents of the students, both schools have ranked high for excellent academics, being rated close to the top 500 schools in the country. During the 2005–2006 school year, some 2,451 students enrolled in Hoover High School, 1,400 in Spain Park High School, with a total of 11,433 students in the Hoover City School System. Spain Park received the National Blue Ribbon Award in 2008, Berry Middle School, which served as the city's first high school before the present Hoover High was constructed, was closed after the 2005–2006 academic year. Students were moved to a new Berry Middle School constructed near the site of Spain Park High School. A poll of residents in 2007 favored selling the school, possibly to the independent Shades Mountain Christian School. Joint offer made for Berry site. The Birmingham News, 2007. Retrieved 9 November 2007. Simmons Middle School and Bumpus Middle School are the city's other middle schools. Given the population expansion, the city built Riverchase Elementary to relieve overcrowding of some schools. The student population bubble is advancing in the system, and in the 2011–2012 academic year, Bumpus Middle School and its students were relocated to the former freshman center of Hoover High School. The former Bumpus site became Brock's Gap Intermediate School in 2011. The former Berry site became the current Bumpus Middle School in 2011. Brock's Gap served 5th and 6th graders until 2018 when Hoover rezoning went into effect. They now serve 3rd, 4th, and 5th graders. Bumpus Middle School served only 7th and 8th graders until 2018 because of Hoover rezoning. They now serve 6th, 7th, and 8th graders. Colleges and universities The Shelby Hoover campus of the Jefferson State Community College is in Shelby County, is in Hoover, near Spain Park High School. Faulkner University has a campus on Valleydale Road. The University of Alabama in Birmingham UAB in downtown Birmingham is only 8 to 10 miles away, and features the Premier Medical School of Alabama. Miscellaneous <inaudible> <inaudible> education <inaudible> The Birmingham Supplementary School Inc. BSS, Ba Mingahamu Ri Ben Yu Buzi Sio Bamingahamu Nihongo Hoshuko, a part-time Japanese school, holds its classes at the Shelby Hoover campus. Its office is at the Honda Manufacturing of Alabama, LLC facility in unincorporated Talladega County, near Lincoln. The school opened on September 1, 2001. Topic Media Hoover has one television station, WBMA, branded as ABC 3340ths, with its studio within the Hoover city limits. The metro area has TV broadcasting stations that serve the Birmingham Anniston Tuscaloosa designated market area, DMA, as defined by Nielsen Media Research. 
Charter Communications, Bright House Networks, and AT&T U-verse provide cable television service to specific communities in Hoover. DirecTV and Dish Network provide direct broadcast satellite television, including both local and national channels. No radio stations operate from Hoover, although residents are served by numerous stations from the Birmingham market. WERCFM is licensed to Hoover, but its studio is located in Birmingham. Three newspapers serve Hoover: The Birmingham News, a tri-weekly newspaper, the Over the Mountain Journal weekly newspapers, and the Hoover Sun, published monthly. Topic: <laughs> Points of interest. Aldridge Botanical Gardens Hoover Metropolitan Stadium formerly Regions Park, home of the SEC Baseball Tournament Riverchase Galleria Ross Bridge Golf Resort and Spa, which boasts the third longest golf course in the world Moss Rock Preserve The Library Theatre